hello everyone and welcome back to the channel today i'll be showing you how to create a room and also join lobbies on your online server for your switch emulator today we'll be using the switch emulator suyu and also ryu jinx they both have two separate processes to them so please stay to listen to both of them first we'll be going over how to join an online or create an online room using your suyu emulator the first thing you're going to need is multiplayer activated for your suyu emulator if you don't have multiplayer activated for your suyu you can go to the video right here and i'll take you on a step-by-step -step method on how to get multiplayer activated on your suyu emulator once multiplayer is activated you'll see the bottom right here when you open your suyu emulator it'll say not connected once we go to the top where it says multiplayer we're going to be simply browsing for a public lobby but the same thing will go on if you create a room you will simply click where it says browse public lobbies you will find whichever room you want to join and you'll double click it once you double click it you should get the indication showing everyone that's in that particular lobby and it'll also show you what games they're playing and if they're playing on the updated version now once we join this public room right here all we'll do is exit out because if you look at the bottom right here it changed from not connected to connected so we don't even need to have this open anymore you'll simply double click whatever game you want to go ahead and join the lobby in for this particular method we'll be using mario kart 8 deluxe once we enter into mario kart 8 deluxe we'll simply go down where it says wireless play once at wireless play you're going to have to click your top two buttons and also you're going to have to click in your left joystick like so once you do that it should switch to land play once you're at land play you'll select it and this is where you'll simply do one of two things you'll join the lobby by putting in the code or you'll simply create a room to which now people can join by simply adding in a code now next i'll be showing you how to play on online servers using your switch emulator ryu jinx now we will not be using the regular version of ryu jinx that i showed you in the previous video with the setup this is a version of ryu jinx that allows land play if you go to the link in the description surprise you know i got you covered once you download this official land play ryu jinx i will not be going over the whole setup because you can just go to this video right here and it's the same setup that i showed you right here this is just a different version that allows you to play online once you unzip it and you open it up for the first time the first thing i want you to do is go to options and then go to settings once you're at settings you'll get this indication right here and we'll want to add our games you'll go where it says game directory and you want to click add and find where you have your games located click it and simply put apply once you hit apply your game should pop up and we're going to go back to the options tab and now we're going to go to where it says input once we're at input we're going to configure our controller we're going to go where it says input device and i'm using the xbox controller so i'll simply select my xbox controller and where it says controller type we want to make sure that it says pro controller the next thing we're going to do is go to our networks tab once at our networks tab if we keep the network passphrase open we'll be able to join any public lobby that's available for the games that we have but if we want to generate our own room we're going to go ahead and click where it says generate random once here we're going to go ahead and erase everything after the dash you have to generate 
more than an eight code passcode for this to work. So we're just gonna put one through eight for this particular example. The last thing we're gonna do here is click where it says guest internet access slash land mode. The next step we're gonna do is go to options and we're simply gonna go where it says manage user profiles. Even if you have a profile here, I want you to go ahead and create a new one. Once you create a new profile and you select whatever icon you want to select, I want you to make sure to double click that profile so that profile is activated. After we do that, the next thing we're going to do is double click on the game that we want to access online mode on. For this particular method, we'll be using Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Once here, we'll scroll down to where it says wireless play and we'll go ahead and click the top two buttons and also the left joystick in like so. We're going to go ahead and change it to land mode. Once it's changed to land mode, we'll go ahead and click it. We should get this indication right here. We will allow it. We're simply going to create a room or we're going to join a lobby by putting in the code. Hopefully this helped you in some way, shape or form. And if it did, go ahead and hit a like button and don't forget to hit that sub. Thank you for tuning into the channel and happy gaming. Surprise, baby. Yippee.